We've added even more to our new version 6, and I think you're going to love the new upload method. It allows you to upload all of the images and then see what you're tagging as you tag them. So you can either select a project and then click on Upload uh, or Acquire Images, or you can click on a project. That'll open it up into the viewer. So now you're looking at all of the thumbnails, and then you can also click Upload Images right from this screen. Here's the new upload form. Go browse to the files that you'd like to upload. In this case, I'm going to select all of them, open, and upload. Now down below in the lower left down here, you're going to see the percentage of uh, how far it's getting as it's uploading the images up to the web server. It'll also tell you up above here in yellow, please wait uploading file. So that way you know the system's working, you know it's uploading, it's loaded all the images, and you'll also notice that it told me that one or more images were skipped because they were duplicates. So what's great about that is now if I set that, and that's a links administrator option, then it will prevent you from continuing to just keep uploading the same image over and over again to the same project. You can just continue to keep browsing to other folders or areas to grab more images or different images. And then now that you've got all of the images loaded, you can just start uh, selecting and tagging. So I'm going to select these drywall photos right here. I'll scroll on down see if there's any more. Looks like that's it. So now I just come over here, put in drywall, the photographer, whatever notes I'd like. And then, of course, you have your user-defined custom search field. So I'm just going to say these are on schedule, add, done, and file those images. So they go away, and I'm left with the remaining images. Let me go ahead and select the site work photos. By the way, you can also select all, deselect all. Let's say you uploaded an image, and for whatever reason you didn't want to bring it into the project, you can delete right from here. So now I'm going to scroll on down, select all of these images, and these are all site work. So file those away. I'm left with the remaining images, so select all of them. These are all tank. And file those images. Now it brings me right on back to my thumbnail browser. I've got all of my images. They're all tagged. They're ready to go and I can just keep uploading more and more images into the system. So I hope you love this new upload method. If you have any questions or comments, please feel free to contact us anytime. Thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.